matrix of push buttons lists all the companies in the East Delta Commerce Center. An off-key melody starts playing after you ring the doorbell. Then a woman picks up the receiver. Kuno, please stop calling here. Grown-ups don't have time for your stupid game. Oh, I'm sorry, officer. I thought you were... But the doorbell is broken and the bookstore shouldn't even be on the list anymore. So I can't help you. Please don't call here again. Thanks. A single beep indicates that the line has gone dead. You ring the doorbell, but no one answers. What an ominous name for a hair salon. Doesn't bode well for anyone's hair. Just seeing the words Andro Orlando gets your hackles up. Its very existence is a threat to your masculinity, to say nothing of your hair. All you hear is static, but no one answers the call. You ring the doorbell, but nothing happens. Try again. You didn't press it hard enough. Thank you for calling the 24-hour window company. This is an automated message. Are you experiencing a window-related emergency? During non-business hours, please call 00725-477. The streets are mean, but we're always there for you. That's only half true. The streets are mean, but they're not there for you. No, not a window-related one. Twelve name cards on the call box read. You wait for a minute or two, but all you get from the call box is silence. No one answers the call. Looks like someone has melted half the plastic off with a lighter. The doorbell doesn't work anymore. You hear static from the intercom speaker. It sounds as if someone has picked up the receiver but isn't saying anything. You can almost hear them breathe. Yes, hello. This is Tricentennial Electric. Have you come to place an order? She sounds almost antique, as if her voice was being played off an old wax cylinder. A receiver must not be working properly. Wait, but what happened to Slipstream SCA? There's no tricentennial electrics on the list. Oh my God. The lieutenant exchanges a look with you. It's a woman, and she knows you. Your heart beats faster. She must be mistaking you for someone else. Who cares that you don't remember her? Just go along with it. No, something's wrong here. Are you sure she's talking to you? Sounds like a ghost. Wind blows through your clothes and you feel detached from your surroundings. Inside the building, a cold memory hangs. Why did you even call? I don't understand. You've been gone for months. I thought you didn't care. Ever since I came to work here, it's been different. As if my mind's been wiped clean. A spot of static overrides her words. When she speaks again, it sounds like she's submerged. It's so nice. It's so nice to be able to finally look again. She sounds like she's about to cry. The cold is deep under your skin, as if you were talking to someone who's a hundred years away. Somewhere inside the building, 
Water is flooding the cellar floor. She doesn't answer. Silence. The only thing you can hear now is static and waves washing ashore on the bay. Another seagull passes by. It's getting cold standing here, staring at the silent call box. It must have been some kind of faulty wiring. We should maybe stop playing with this doorbell. It looks ancient. You press the number sign on the keypad that terminates the call. Twelve name cards on the call box read. Whatever she says, it can't hurt you. You're a different person now. Stronger, healthier, and... All right, maybe not healthier, but it's a bonus that you've drunk so hard you can't remember any of your past relationships. Oblivion's the ace in your corner. There's a light buzz as you press the doorbell, waiting for her to answer the call. It's cold outside, and you can hear the wind blowing into the speaker. A strange metallic taste fills your mouth as you stare at the intercom. There's the static again, whispering like a seashell pressed against the air. Yes, hello, this is Tricentennial Electric. Have you come to place an order? My gosh. Here come the bad vibes again. Relax. Distance yourself from it. It's you. My God. I didn't think I would hear your voice again. Wait. Is she... silvery puffs in the air. Ever since I came to work here, it's been different. As if my mind has been wiped clean. It's so nice. It's so nice to be able to finally forget about you. And then it hits you. She tries again not to cry, and still doesn't succeed completely. Her quiet sobs sound old and distant, as if her voice is being played off a wax cylinder. Real or not, your mirror neurons react. It feels painful to be listening to this. Anger boils up in your chest. Her sound melts into the static from a long distance phone call. From time to time, you can hear people talking in the distance, but can't make out any words. This is where you hung up the call the last time, but the recording is still going. A phone rings in the office with an old fashioned chime and someone walks by in a pair of heels. The static is like a warm blanket wrapped around the sounds. No one replies, but the static grows stronger like rainfall. Then a female voice speaks out, completely different from the one before, glorious and total somehow, crawling inside your head. For 300 years I have been here, volatile and luminous, made of sodium and rain. If you want me, you can find me on the beach. Don't I have nearby? 
soul. It was a recording trapped in the circuitry from some ancient tenant. This sometimes happens. Shall we conclude here? We have other mysteries to solve. Don't take this the wrong way, but during our short stint working together, something weird is almost always happening to you. That is true. Silence. No one's home at Fortress Accident. Silence. No one answers the doorbell. Nothing happens after you ring the doorbell. They don't want to talk to you. You're going to just stand there and take it from a doorbell? Your fist crashes into the metal. Pure physical vengeance. It feels good at first, and then it starts to hurt. Silence. No one answers your call. This button looks new, but someone has removed the name card. Nothing happens when you try to ring it. Huh. This button looks new. It's probably not connected yet. 